I'm Andres Razans, ambassador of Latvia to the United States since 2012. And uh, well, it's uh, my third time I'm visiting the state of Washington, although it's the first time I'm here. Why now? Why Washington? For me as ambassador, it gives a great opportunity really to come, uh, to meet people, uh, to say what we are doing as, a, as Latvia, uh, to tell that well, 25 years of our independence meant something. Uh, we began from the very point where so many countries that broke out from Soviet domination in, in, in 1990, 1991. Uh, there are countries wh with whom we started from the same positions in, in, in 91. And, and then you see that there are developments in some place where wars, uh, war is, has been fought right now. And then you have a country like mine, Latvia, who is now in charge of, of the biggest trade bloc and, and, and political and cultural union in the world, EU. How do most Latvians view Russia? Uh, I think <sighs> Russia has been always uh, our neighbor. It's, it's nothing that we just woke up a year ago and, and uh, understood that we have uh, a neighbor. Uh, and and uh, historically, I think uh, we have had difficult moments uh, through centuries. It's not first time when when we see uh, very aggressive behavior coming from Moscow. In thanks God, not yet directly in the Baltic region. It's it's we, we don't have direct military threat. It's exaggeration. Uh, when 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 I read that that, uh, well, we might be the next target because we have 26% ethnic Russians in Latvia. I think it's stupidity uh, at the high level because it, it would be the same thing to say that, well, one country uh, in our immediate neighborhood has enough, uh, quite a many Muslim people, uh, around close to 10%, and it, but it doesn't mean that all 10% will be fighting in Ir Syria or Iraq in, ra in lines of ISIS. I think it's, it's simply it comes because of people don't try to analyze realities on, on the ground. One thing that you hope Washington leaders take away from your visit? Uh, well, first of all, uh, I wish that they put a pin on, on the European map very in the north. Uh, with the name Latvia or Riga. Uh, you know, Europe is not only five countries. Europe would be poor with, with just five winning countries from the Second World War. There are other countries in Europe uh, with smaller but with great potential, great opportunities. Those are Americans who engage with us, they know that. Uh, our problem is that we have been hidden behind the double Berlin Wall during Cold War time. This small wall in Berlin and huge Soviet border in our case. Uh, that's, that's, that's past, that's history. 